Or hey, Visantir. So we're gonna talk about the new event that's happening in Pokemon Sword. The new event dens can spawn Mewtwo now, if you didn't know, at a ten percent rate, and it drops like bottle caps and ability capsules and PP up. A lot of the battle items are pretty nice. And there is also the starters, the Kentonian starters, so you can get the hidden abilities if you want. Um, they also spawn in here as well. So let's talk about Mewtwo. You can't catch it, unfortunately, but it does give them nice drops, so it's still nice to grind, especially if you're into competitive battling. And two out of the three Mewtwo start off with shields, and that can be complicated, as you can see in the battle, um, what kind of strategy you want. Mewtwo does hit pretty hard, so one of the strategies you can go with is to use one person have Grimmsnar because Grimmsnar is dark and fairy. That the Mewtwo has fighting moves, ice moves, fire moves, and psychic moves. Um, so at least you'd be resisting the psychic and just build a bulky Grimmsnar with Prankster. Use Light Screen because it's mostly a special attacker, and then once in a while I'll do Brick Break. One of them does Brick Break. I forgot which one. They do Brick Break and then Max Knuckle, so that's why you have Reflect. You can also run Taunt. You must run Taunt. Um, one thing you can do is that if you fight a Mewtwo and it starts off with shields, it's going to always start off with shields. So um, the one with shields is pretty much hard mode because you can't taunt it because every once in a while I'll do Calm Mine. And then if it gets too buffed with this boost, you're going to get you get rolled over. So what you want to do is that you can always just reset for a new Mewtwo until you get one that doesn't start with a shield and then you have a Prankster Grimstar that does a taunt in the beginning that you'll see in this battle um, that I'll show you in a bit. And you want to run Pokemon that are like somewhat bulky enough to like tank the hits because you know, he does a lot of damage. But if you can get a taunt off first turn, it can't calm mine, so, and then you can put light screens up. What you want to do is not hopefully not get one shot, so you can run like Necromosma, the Lunata version. You can run pretty much dark Pokemon, so you can be resistant to the psychic moves at least. Um, so you don't want to run Dragon because it has ice. Um, you don't want to run Steel because it has fire. It's okay to run Tyranitar even though it has fighting moves, but um, usually Tyranitar is pretty bulky, so you're good. So yeah, let's get to the battle and hopefully enjoy the video. Okay, so what you want to do is you want to just keep throwing wishing pieces inside the dens, as you can see here. Um, so until you get an event den, and then you pretty much know it's event den if you see like Cantonia Starters or GMAX Doctor City. Pretty much, um, what I, or first from Cerebi, right? You see those lists of Pokemon. If you see any of those, then is it event den. So you just get a whole bunch of wishing pieces. Um, from farming watts, you should have quite a bit if you do the time skip trick. And you pretty much just keep going until you find the event then. I haven't found one here yet, and then you keep looking, you go to the next den. So this is a good place in which you can keep throwing wishing pieces, because there's like three dens right next to each other. This is like in Stone Deep Wilderness. And there it is, there's a war turtle. So, we're gonna do the, the good, I'm gonna do the time skip until I find a Mewtwo. Alright, so I'm going back to the beam. I had to get Spirit Break. Um, is it can lower your spe the opponent's special attack, so you at least have one attack to do. That's, that could be your fourth move. So you want to disconnect from the internet first, because you don't want to spam rooms while you're doing this. So you're going to click, you're going to go in, invite others, right? If I would just click on it. <laughs> and then you will press home, you go to system settings, you go scroll down to the bottom, system, date time, turn that off. And then you increase it by one day until you find a Mewtwo. And then you pretty much do this the same way. If you want to, you have a Mewtwo that has shields and you want to go the easier mode, because it's pretty hard if you're fighting straight off with shields. Um, you pretty much just reset for another Mewtwo doing this the same way. All right, so here we have me, Sherry, which is Crucify. We have Eddie, with Infinite Eddie, and we have Pokey Stevers here. So we're going to go into this battle. Uh, let me just skip to the beginning, yeah? There we go. And my Grimmsnarl, you'll see, uh, this one doesn't have a shield, so it's a lot easier. So first off, you want to do, since the shield, the Dynamax, the Dynamax shield actually block the taunt and, you know, statuses. So you can only do it when it doesn't have shield. So that's why you don't, you want one that doesn't have shield. But then you don't want it, if you don't taunt it, and then just keep doing combine, and then you can get rolled over. So I'm going to start off with taunt here. 
Um, there ran Necromosa, another Mewtwo, and another Grimmsnarl. So I'm just gonna, we're just gonna watch this battle. We're gonna taunt, right? So then now he can't do Calm Mind. He usually does an attack first, and then the second move is the Calm Mind. It makes it a lot easier if you're able to taunt it. Either does Calm Mind on a nasty plot, it's one of those. Either way, he's gonna raise his special attack. And also, what you wanna do is that if your HP is low, you want to heal. Use like, don't be afraid to use max potions. Don't be afraid to use full restores. Um, whatever you need to do to not lose your life, which costs the whole, you know, the overall team. You can't lose four times or you get kicked out and you gotta start over. See, you try to do a nasty plot. You can't do it after time. Of course, you can't do it after shield. And then now, after you do taunt, you just do it up light screen. Because most of the attacks are special attacks. Straight to light screen. Makes it the attacks that you take a lot easier. It does uh, quite a bit of damage. Of course, I'm running uh, Grimmsnar with Prankster with uh, Careful Nature. And it has full HP investment. And I do have some defense investment and then mostly in special defense. It's a bulky boy. We have a gigantic. Not Gigantamax. Dynamax. My bad. Dynamax. Necromosma here. Because if you do the Sogaleo version, um, it'll have steel. And you don't want to be... You don't want to get Mask Flare or Fire Blast to the face. Yeah, but it's light screens. I'm playing support. Though that's what I'm doing. It just makes everyone live longer. There's that Flamethrower. Oh, burn. So you want to be level 100 as well, because this is hits pretty hard. You want to maximize your, your vitality and your damage output. The important thing is to stay alive. To me, in my opinion, this battle is way more fun than the regular raids. I can't wait for a Cloud Thunder to drop, and then um, we're going to be fighting Legendary, and it's going to be rough as this, which is nice. Not easy. And I don't want it to be easy because it's a freaking five star raid and it's a legendary raid. So I think they're, I don't know, they may be doing this as a. testing this out. I'm loving it though. I, I do love how hard the raid is because people are complaining how easy it is, right? Five star raid so easy. I think they just need to bump it just, uh, not just a little bit. Yeah, don't be afraid to heal yourself. Um, Eddie, unfortunately, did not have full restores. I think he, um, he did get some candies um, from an earlier Mewtwo raid, so it got to 100. But he doesn't have any full restores. Oh, they're frozen. Oh, oh thought out right away. That was freaking hacks when that happened. Oh my god. Yeah, Sherry got frozen from, from, from that attack and then just thought out right away and just did the max attack. Yeah, and then Spirit Break. You only want to do it pretty much when you know you, sh you have nothing else you can do. You already taunt it. You already put up shields. What else can you do? Might as well attack and lower the special attack. Great. Well, see, now the taunt wore off and you want to taunt again. You want to make sure that taunt is on so it doesn't do any buffs and steamroll everyone. <laughs> Fortunately, I cannot play any mute uh, of the volume because I had music playing in the background during the stream. But yeah, feel free to drop by the stream if you guys want. We can hang out, listen to some nice music, or you can judge my music, whatever. Most of the people like my music. And then we do some Pokemon battles. I also stream Arknights. We play some Smash from time to time. Pokemon Masters from time to time as well. Oh, Nullify. Eh, doesn't really matter. We're still okay. Since he didn't buff himself, even though that crit did quite a um, bit, um, the thing's blocking the HP. That's fine. 
Oh, that blizzard. Like, 99 HP. Oh my god, this Mewtwo was so lucky too. Like, it would keep freezing and critting all over the place. That Mewtwo is frozen. Don't be afraid to use a full restore, you know? Heal that frozen and heal your HP. So I think at this point, I went for a heal. Or did I YOLO this? I don't know. I think I went for a heal. Yeah, I went for a heal. I don't have any max potions. But why need it when you have full restores? I need to get some more. One thing you can do is, um, if you have a limited watt, you find one of those uh, watt traders and then you would just buy those luxury balls and then just sell them. And then use that money to buy full restores. Yeah. Here for the side. Evil. Evil attempt. Our max hailstorm. Oof. Like, just hit me, man. Just keep hitting me. Nope, didn't hit me. If I was, because I'm dark, I would have. Then it hit me with Aura Spear. Crit. <laughs> Freaking crit, man. The hail stopped. We pretty much got this in the bag if, as long as I keep my the taunts up. And then any, I have Light Clay. You want to run Light Clay? I forgot to mention that. Light Clay will help you um, have the screens last longer. Eight turns. Right, I'm going to keep healing myself. Or do I? I think I want to. Okay, I yolo. I yolo this time. It's like, eh, I think I could live one more hit. Just gonna yolo. Screw it. I think Sherry also yolo with me. Can't see it from there, but Sherry was also low on HP. It hit me. It didn't hit me. I think it hit the Mewtwo and the Grimmsnarl, so that's good. They were at full HP, they just came in, right? So. Oh, but the Blizzard, though. Oof. Still like, I'm frozen again. <laughs> but yeah, Light Clay will make it last um, the screens longer, so you don't have to do much. You just put it up, and then it's pretty much going to last the whole battle. Most of the time, you're going to kill it with an 8 turns, or it'll gonna kill you. You and eight turns. Get yeah, my spirit break as well. Lower his stats. We're gonna keep I'm low on HP. Alright. Choke off the taunt. I think I went for the heal. Just because we're we have like most of us were like a low HP. Want to make sure you not take the L accidentally for not healing. You're gonna knock us all out at once with Blizzard. We have people that are frozen. I'm on low HP. All right, everyone just healing. Yeah, and I don't think Eddie had heals, so he went for the attack. Of course, get wrecked. Get attacked instead. Live though, so lucky. Unless, unless this, I think, yeah. Oof. Yeah, that happened. But it's okay. We only lost, what, like, Three lives so far. We just need to do one more attack. We good. We don't need. We don't need to taunt anymore. It can. It can buff all at once. We don't. I don't even care. But we got. We got free heals. <laughs> we got free heals. So. We didn't really need it, but it was a nice insurance. Yeah, look at that one HP. 
Oh my god, I think Mewtwo is faster than... Yeah. So, we're gonna take out... We think all the hits and then... Oh. Crit me. Believe that? It crit me. And it didn't hit me with side strike instead. It didn't hit me. And there we go. We defeated Mewtwo. I think this one we got a ability capsule. Everyone did, actually. It's super nice. Got the bottle cap, got a ability capsule, got two PP ups. We're gonna be farming more of this, so feel free to drop by. Hey, thanks for watching, and if you like this video, please do give it a like and subscribe for upcoming videos. Let me know what you guys want to do in the comments down below and anything else you guys want to talk about. And with that, all my socials are down below as well. And I do stream on Twitch. My schedule is on Twitch as well as one of the panels. So with that, later days.